Okay, so I'm thinking about the circumcision of my penis. It's shaped like a mushroom. And the penis is circumcised so that when it goes into the vagina, it actually ejaculates without having to take a long time. You know, it makes it more sensitive to friction. Okay, so the mushroom shape of my penis is meant to go into the woman's vagina. Where do mushrooms grow from? My penis grows. Mushroom grows. Mushrooms grow from what? Dead and decaying things. Dead and decaying flesh and plant matter. Red is the flesh. The plant matter is green. But a mushroom is what color? Same color as my hat. Grows off of dead and decaying red flesh and dead and decaying green things. Does it need water? It does. You can buy silo salad and spores, which I do not advise anyone to use those. You can get the same effect from eating mushrooms. You can get the same effect from eating mushrooms. And the mushroom that grew was eaten. The mushroom in the movie Alice in Wonderland, the caterpillar, the mushroom grew. Um, and the caterpillar was on it. Peace, peace. So my penis grows from the smell of dead and decaying things. Is that what that means? I can't really ascertain that that be the case, but like vaginas do smell like fish sometimes. I don't know. It doesn't have to. They're self-cleaning when they're young. And they can be hot and ready like, you know, the pizza. But when they get older, or after they catch an STD, you know, from some dirty dingling dude, then they end up having to, you know, they those, those vaginas need help and assistance. I'm not calling anyone out. It happens to the worst of us. You know, you can get STDs from just touching the surface. You ain't got to actually have sex with somebody to have that get STD. You can get an STD from a stool, anything. Peace, peace, peace.